Hey friends and happy holidays. Tonight I am hanging out at Disney's Wilderness Lodge. I absolutely love it here during the holidays especially because of all the Christmas decorations and the Christmas music. But tonight we also might be seeing the electric water pageant actually debuting for the first time since the park closed. And I'm very excited to see that. So let's go do this. Honestly, who doesn't love this resort? The combination between the gigantic Christmas tree, the garland, and even the multiple fireplaces throughout the resort just makes it the perfect place for the holidays. A couple of new things opened up that last time we were here they were closed. Territory Lounge being one of them. This is one of my favorite lounges actually at all the Walt Disney World resorts. And they actually may have some Christmas drinks so I'm excited to see if they do. Of course, we have to check on our second floor fireplace that nobody usually is at, but recently it's become a little bit more popular. This is one of my favorite little hidden nooks. So you actually come up here and you get a beautiful view of the lobby. And they even have that big fireplace over there. And I just like it because you get a little private section, like your own little fireplace. I don't spend too much time there. Gotta let other people enjoy it. So if you guys do plan on hanging out there, try to keep it to like an hour and a half minimum. You know, you don't want to be taking it up all night. But as we head down to the Territory Lounge, Jackie's having a hard time saying goodbye. I think she really likes it up there. Luckily, we were also able to grab a dinner reservation for Whispering Canyon, and we're actually gonna eat there. You've never eaten there before, have you? Never eaten there, no. So it's gonna be Jackie's first time, and I'm excited. Me Ooh. too. It's gonna be really I'm delicious. Hungry. Oh boy. Right here it is, the Territory Lounge, right next to Artisan Point, which isn't open at this time, but the lounge is. And like I said, this is something new because just a couple of weeks ago, this wasn't open yet. I'm excited because I really do love it in here. And here is the Territory Lounge. And like I said, they do have holiday drinks. I'm so excited because they're actually brilliantly named. We have a holiday featured cocktails, the Winter Wonderland and the Good Tidings. Both of them look fantastic. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get one and one and try them both. I'm excited. I absolutely love this lounge. It's such a chilled, relaxed atmosphere and they have some of the best chairs to actually sit down and enjoy a drink. Look at these comfy chairs. They're amazing, aren't they? So comfortable. And like I said, it just fits the decor of the room. Unbelievable. Here are the holiday cocktails. We got the Good Tidings, which actually has blackberry brandy, and then the Winter Wonderland that has apple liqueur with cranberry juice and vodka. I don't know. We haven't decided. Yeah, we haven't decided whose is whose is the thing. We just have one of each. So. Any mini money mo. Um, Any mini money mo, catch a tiger by its toe. If he hollers, let him go. Any mini money. Mo. But does Mo mean you drink that one or you drink, or I drink that one? I want the blackberry brandy. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to you. The Good Tidings drink is actually just like a blackberry brandy mimosa. So if you don't like champagne, I'm sure this isn't going to be the best drink for you. I do like brandberry, uh, blackberry brandy, but I don't know. It still doesn't kind of overpower the champagne. But I never say no to a drink. <laughs> A couple of tables left already, but take a listen to that music. The acoustics in here is amazing. I'm, I'm overcome with emotion at this somber Christmas music. It's the Christmas spirit. As we were sitting here, our table actually was called, so now we can actually head over to Whispering Canyon and get some food, and I think we can take our drinks with us. Yeah, because it's the same, it's like the same thing. And by the way, I finished up the blackberry brandy one, and now I switched to the winter wonderland. I have to say, I like this one a lot better. And here we are. I absolutely love it in here. <laughs> They're arguing. <laughs> this is also gonna be the first time that I'm gonna sit in the library section. This is the quieter section. Oh, I like it. Thank you. Call it the library? When you go to a library, there is one no talking. Over here? Yep. Please don't go down those steps because if you do, at the end of the trail, there's no more restaurant. Oh, there's no more restaurant beyond those steps. Maybe later on you leave. Right, and you know. sure. <laughs> 
If you're not aware, Whispering Canyon Cafe is known for their all you care to enjoy signature skillets. They have the traditional, the pig, the land and sea, and the plant-based. It's $34 a person, and it actually has all different offerings. I normally go for the pig because you get the piggy wins, but today, I think I'm just gonna stick with the traditional and then see what Jackie wants, but this is such a good value for the price. They're all different and they're all amazing. The sad thing though is this is Jackie's first time coming here and I know that Jackie actually likes ketchup, but they're not doing that anymore. So you're not gonna get a bunch of ketchup thrown at you. Yeah. Oh yeah, sorry. Yeah. Welcome in, welcome in. Ooh, well, Ooh. we're gonna sit down and talk and not work. Yeah, join oh, us. Yeah, yeah. Grab a seat. Tempting. <laughs> the cornbread and coleslaw has arrived. Jackie, the coleslaw is all yours, but I am going to have a piece of cornbread. Look at this. You know what they say, though. Don't eat all the cornbread because the skillets are coming next. Oh, that's how they get you. That's how they get you. They get all full. They're not going to get me. They're not going to get us. <laughs> Can we have some silverware? Absolutely not. This is a barn. <laughs> It's a barn, eat with your hands. <laughs> no fancy price, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. The cornbread is actually very decent. I don't mind it, I don't like it with the butter. Oh! That was Jackie's camera. Call security. Are we good? Luckily, Jackie's camera is okay. The, the cameras are pretty sturdy. We both have the same ones. I remember I dropped mine from Animal Kingdom Lodge balcony one time. I dropped mine a lot. I'm very yeah. clumsy. But as long as the camera's good, all good. <laughs> uh, traditional and a piggy one. Piggy one right here. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, and then the traditional. Beautiful. That's a lot of food, right? Oh my gosh! Yeah. Wow, it all looks so fresh and gorgeous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> take it with me, all right, right out the door. Yeah, I'll take it. Gosh. As you can see, both of the skillets came out. This is the piggly one, and it comes with the pig wings, and then I think uh, the pork belly, and then that one actually has the chicken, and then the brisket. Now the brisket is what I love. So I feel like I should have gotten that with the brisket. I wonder if they'll let me do that. I'm like, if I get a reorder, mm. maybe. Gosh. I think I'll grab some of the pork belly. I think this is pork belly. No, that's brisket. This is pork belly. What's the this? piggy comes with it. That's ribs. What's ribs, this? that's pulled pork. That's ribs, that's smoked sausage. That's the brisket. And this is the uh, citrus chicken. Wow, it's delicious. Yeah. It's all so good. So much good stuff right here. Mm. I do love the sausage though, so oh, I'm gonna have a little sausage. sausage. I'm eating it right out of my, my thing, my skillet. Oh, <laughs> well, I'm gonna do it too then. I'm just eating right out of the skillet. Yeah, let's just eat right out of the skillet. What plate for? This is my skillet. <laughs> I'm gonna try with the sausage first because I know I love the sausage. Mm. I feel like it's so hard to do like a full dining review. I've done it before where I've went back and actually eaten every one and then talked about it. And that's a separate video. You can check that out. I'll put it in the uh, description. But because we have so many other things here, I can't do that. I can just tell you what some of my favorite things are. I can tell you the sausage was phenomenal. I always love it. The pork belly was okay, but I want some of that brisket. So maybe we can do like a little swip swap. Mm -hmm. Like you order a little bit of the brisket. Mm -hmm. I'll order a little bit of the pork belly. Mm -hmm. You know, we can share. Like in, in an exchange. Don't That's go down those steps, sir. Oh, end of the trail. End, end of the end trail. Of the trail. <laughs> Going all in here. Are there people trapped inside these cameras? Because we keep yeah. talking to them. Yeah. Yes, they are. They're, They're trapped in inside. And Somebody needs to let them out. I'm not letting mine out. I'm not letting the people in my camera out at all. They're staying, they're stuck in there. Well, they're trying to escape because you're throwing them on the ground. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I want to try the ribs, so I decided to actually cut it off the bone. Normally, I would just grab the bone, but I don't want to get all saucy, especially if we're <laughs> going to be standing by the water. Mosquitoes are attracted to the barbecue stain. I know I had a barbecue stain on my white t-shirt. <laughs> Regardless though, I think they're going to be phenomenal. And it's kind of weird to eat ribs with a fork.
decided after my Christmas drink to get myself a good old moose head, Jackie is going to try to get a Modelo yeah. if she'll let you have one because she said you were cut off because of the drink. Yeah, you know, I'm trying to get a Modelo over here, you know? Between me and you, Allie, come on. We must be walking somewhere else. We ain't got that. I just saw it on the menu. The menu lies. It's a big Now you're really cut off. Now you're really <laughs> cut off. It's not even on the menu. <laughs> what do we got here? Oh, and it looks like our refill came. Look at all of that. So because we both got one in one skillet, they just added it all together. We got some sausage, some brisket, and then some pork belly. So you could try that and I could try this. Great. I'm going in for the I'm going in for the brisket. Yeah. Well, Jackie got her blue moon. My, my blue moon arrived. It's this is honestly <laughs> probably the best blue moon I've ever had. Thank you. Thank that you is so, so precious. That. Keep that forever. Hey, that one's mine, right? Go, yeah, you're keeping that. I love it. I'm all <laughs> real blue moon. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> I think I'm diving in on the brisket now. I'm excited. This is the one thing that I've missed from the traditional one. I feel like I did a very good job finishing that skillet. So much food, right? Absolutely amazing. I think my favorite thing had to be that brisket. The brisket and then the ribs, all the way. That was absolutely amazing. One of my picks for the best food for the price, $34. Even without the price, I'd go up to paying maybe $40, $50 for that skillet. It's amazing. But we need to get down by the water because hopefully the water pads don't come out. And it's the end of the trail. Thank you. Yep, come on through. The end of the trail. Diddle-oo. Diddle as we're walking down to the actual water, look how beautiful it is in here. Also, I want to point out, whoever decorated their balcony all the way up there, that's amazing. Look at all those twinkly lights, and they're multicolor ones. We're not 100% sure that the actual parade is going to happen tonight. It's just been rumored to. So if not, we're just going to hang out by Geyser Point and then maybe take up a spot next to a fireplace. Sounds like a pretty interesting night to me. Who doesn't like a night out at Geyser Point? You can hear the horn from the boats. Look, that one's heading to the Magic Kingdom as we speak. This is such an amazing view. You can see the spotlights from the castle projection show and the clouds are just passing through it. Look at all of Bay Lake. Isn't it amazing? Right over there is the Contemporary and then Bay Lake Tower. And then right in the middle here, that is Discovery Island. And then you got Fort Wilderness there. There's lots of great viewing here. And plus this outdoor patio is heated and they actually pump the music. So if it does happen, we'll be able to hear that classic music. But I think we're gonna stick to where we were standing. Take a look at this though, at Geyser Point, they also have some new holiday drinks, including the New Year drink. They have a ringing in the New Year drink. Crown Royal Whiskey with peach brandy liqueur and lemonade. I honestly just might have to get this. Oh, and there it is, ringing in the new year. So we're ringing in the new year, but technically it's uh, still not Christmas yet, but I like sitting out here. The breeze is nice. We're listening to Nick Magical News Live <laughs> to see if the uh, water pageant comes by the Polynesia because it looks like he's streaming on Facebook there. Yeah. <laughs> but hopefully soon that music will kick on. I'll get so excited, right? Yeah, when they too. hit the thing, you're going to be like, you yeah! <laughs> the electrical Main Street electrical yes. train, which I loved so much. Like, it's like there's something just mm. just out of nowhere. I hope it kicks on real loud. Oh, It'll catch us off guard. I think we'll all go. Woo! <laughs> oh, oh, look at this, God, guys! It's it coming out. That it's coming it. out, but it looks like they're gonna start in the back here. They're gonna start maybe Why at the Wilderness Lodge yet? and then actually come in the back way. Wow! Oh I see gosh, it. I see it. There it is. It's not like fully on yet, though. Oh, I'm. Oh. <laughs> 
hope this rain stays away. Is it too early to already proclaim this is my favorite New Year drink? Because I absolutely love this. I mean, I don't know if I can tie this into the holiday drinks or not, but the peach liqueur mixes with the Crown Royal. Absolutely amazing. And then lemonade. I hear it. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I, hear I, hear it. It. I hear it! I hear it! <gasps> there it is! Woo! Look at the initial turnout here, guys. I'm so happy to see so many people enjoying this. <laughs> yeah! It was so great to actually see that again. Now it's actually heading over to Fort Wilderness, and then I think it hits up the Contemporary and Bay Lake Tower. But wow, so amazing, right? I just love the music. The music is what does it for me. Now we're gonna head over to Roaring Fork and pick up some hot chocolates so that maybe we can go and uh, sit by a fireplace and just kind of relax for a little bit. I feel like that really is a good way to cap off the night. Oh, you can see, there it is over by Fort Wilderness right now. Oh man, that was great to see. And here it is. This is a quick service section. Like I said, they have hot chocolates, so I mobile ordered some already. All we have to do is pick it up. Ah, Thank you. you. Some hot chocolate one. delight. Oh yes, put the sleeve on, huh? Because it's hot. Do you think I can do this one-handed? No. <laughs> I got skills. I got skills. Oh. Oh. Let's see. Can we do this one-handed? Oh, you know, I'm coming in. I can assist. do it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> now that we have our hot chocolates, we had to find a fireplace spot. Most of them were preoccupied. So we came all the way up to, I think, the fourth floor right here. Normally there is a fireplace, but it's not on. But it's still a very comfy spot. Don't you like it? Oh, you can see the reflection of the tree. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. Lovely just to sit here, sip on some hot cocoa. I can picture a fireplace and I can look at the Christmas tree and hear the music. That's what matters. Oh, it's good.
and with that i think we are done here so much fun just chilling at the wilderness lodge it's such a beautiful resort and to see the electric water pageant return was amazing just hearing the music kind of gave me a little goosebumps and then when everyone started cheering it was it was something awesome they experienced in person like here anywho's i hope you enjoyed the video i enjoyed making it we'll see you next time bye Bye.